This tutorial teaches you how to create a vintage look in Adobe After Effects. Create a new project, and import your video. Drag your video onto the new composition icon. Go to Layer, New, Adjacent Layer. Go to Effect, Color Correction, Tint. Set the amount to Tint, to 50%. Go to Effect, Color Correction, Curves. Create an S-curve, in order to add some contrast. Do the same thing for the red and green, and the other way for the blue. Go to Effect, Color Correction, Levels. Set the output black to 10, to get the old effect from the vintage. Go to Layer, New, Solid, and create a black layer. Go to Effect, Noise and Grain, Fractal Noise. Set the contrast to 250, and the brightness to minus 80. Click on Transform and set the scale to 2500. Set the complexity to 1. Go to Effect, Color Correction, Hue Saturation. Click on Colorize. Set the Colorize Hue to 7, and the Colorize Saturation to 70. Right click on the top layer, go to Blending Mode, and click on Add. Press T on your keyboard, and set the opacity to 50%. Go to Offset Turbulence and click on the stopwatch. Go to the end of the clip, and set the right value of Offset Turbulence to 5000. Go down to Evolution, and Alt-click on the stopwatch. Type in Time Asterisk 70, and then just click away from the box. To make the burn effect flicker, go to Opacity and Alt-click on the stopwatch. Type in Wiggle 3, 50 and then click away from the box. This expression states that 3 times a second, 
it should wiggle 50%. Finally we will add a vignette, so go to layer, new, solid, and create a black layer. Go to rectangle tool, hold your left mouse button, and select the ellipse tool. Double click on the ellipse, and then go to the mask, and select the subtract option. Select the top layer, press F on your keyboard, and set the mask feather to 400. Press T on your keyboard, and set the opacity to 70%. Duplicate the top layer, by pressing Ctrl D on your keyboard, and set its blending mode to overlay. Drag the layer below the other one, press T on your keyboard, and set the opacity to 40%. Click on RAM Preview, to see the result.